In this video, I will show you how you can create a new project in eTabs. You will go in the file, new model. If you have already saved a model or working in a model, you can use open. There is also other options. So now in this video, I will creating a new model. When I click the new model, then there will be three settings appear. First one is use saved user default setting. In this setting, you can, for example, you are working on a project. You have created a material, uh, for example, 3000 PSI, 4000 PSI and steel bars, uh, 60 grade, 40 grade. And also you have uh, selected the unit system, for example, for the bars, uh, area bar, inch square and for the uh, weight calculation, loading kg in kg or kilonewton. So all these settings you have saved in the previous model. So you can uh, also save uh, your unique uh, these settings for yourself. For example, whenever you open a, uh, a new project, then you can just click. It will automatically bring the settings which you have saved uh, for your eTab software. Then the second option is use settings from a model file. In this uh, option, for example, you have multiple projects, steel project, concrete project, or maybe wood project. So for example, you are going to start a concrete project. So all the sections, all the materials are defined in some, in, in, in some model. So you have to just click, then the software will ask where is that model you will just click software automatically bring the settings from that model now uh, i am again going back file new model i am not taking so you can study by yourself here is the third use built-in settings so i am basically working from a scratch file so that's why here is the display unit system metric SI, US customary, F FPS system, MKS system and for example uh, for steel section database here is the latest AISC14 and if there is uh, M it means it is a metric system database and it is a FPS system database. So steel design code here is also previous design codes and different countries design codes also present. So you can select according to your country. In the concrete design code, uh, there is also many codes, for example, Italian, Hong Kong, uh, Canadian, ACI, American Concrete Institute code. So according to your requirements, you can select your model. So here I will click, I am uh, selecting the third, third setting, use built-in settings with, okay. Here is a different options. I want to start from a blank document and if my grids are easy or not some have some complex guide line, uh, grid lines. So I will just create X grid lines, Y grid lines, how many number of stories. Uh, so you can change here and just click then automatically your model will uh, be open. For example, here there the number of grid lines is four in X direction. I am just making it six. Uh, number of grid lines in the y direction for um, that's okay spacing of grids in x direction that's the 24 feet just i'm making 15 feet uh, letting it uh, 24 feet in the y direction and here is the number of stories just uh, for example uh, number of stories are four just i am making it to uh, 11 Typical story height and bottom story height. For example, uh, your bottom story height, which is a ground floor story, uh, a typical, uh, most mostly its uh, height is larger than the rest of the stories. So for example, the lower story is 15 feet and rest of the above stories are of 12 feet. And you can also select what uh, uh, value you are going to design. So here I have selected the grid only, okay. So there is also another uh, other options that are the templates. Uh, already uh, uh, given by the uh, eTab software. So here is steel deck, staggered uh, truss, flat slab, flat slab with perimeter beams, waffle slab, two way or rib slab. So I will also discuss one of these. Here I am hitting OK.
so you can see uh, x and y so here is the spacing 24 feet 24 feet 24 feet and here is the setting which i have selected 15 feet 15 feet 15 feet 15 feet 6 in uh, one direction and 4 in the as uh, given in the uh, start of the model so here is the 3d view of grid the system here is the stories so i can also edit whatsoever i like for example i will go in the edit edit stories and grid system so here is 11 stories i also uh, can change the story heights for example here that's all the editable for example 10 feet and it will automatically uh, calculate the elevation okay so similarly the grid x and y grid data you can also modify the spacing for example 15 15 you can change according to your requirement okay If there is something like this happen just click here it will automatically refresh your model so now i will again create a, a second new model uh, before creating a second new model i will just uh, save my model save as that is new project one okay. okay now my model is saved now i will create a second model new model use built-in setting okay so now i will select a one template for example flat slab with perimeter beams so here is the grid line if i am satisfied i can change so i am just uh, in this time i will just play with uh, flat slab with perimeter beams okay so now the the new popa window asking for me how much uh, overhangs just like the cantilever portions over the slab 0 0.5 feet so whatsoever i can change one feet uh, in the x direction left edge right edge in the y direction draw panels it's up to me i want or not so let it be happen as given in the uh, template fixed restrain that bottom means boundary conditions pin hinge connection fix fix boundary conditions that is the diaphragm rigid semi rigid no diaphragm here is the loading condition we can also apply here uh, for example uh, dead load additional uh, the self weight the software automatically calculates so here i am putting the additional uh, dead load which is super dead load that is the 50 and the live load is 100 concrete column all the sections are selected so you can also edit at the later stages now here i am clicking ok model is, uh, template is selected ok it will take just uh, some seconds then this will appear so here your model is appeared you can also change the number of stories all things uh, that are created by this template are editable 